what your silence does to the narcissist. The narcissist needs a reaction. They need some form of emotional response. They need to know that you're still going through it. They may even try to read your body language and facial expressions to see if you're happy, angry or sad. Because they need a reaction. They need to know that their actions or words are having an effect on you. And when they know that it is having an effect on you, they will continue to intimidate you until you finally snap and react to them. But sometimes, when you give the narcissist your silence, they will often go silent with you. They will see it as a competition. They will see it as a game. And in this game, they will expect to smash you to smithereens because this is their playing field. They've had a lot of practice and they believe that they are the master of their craft while you are the student. You're just learning what you know from them. But they will see it as an insult that you think you can use their own tactics against them. As though you don't recognize how powerful and intelligent they are. As though you think you can do it better than them. Because the narcissist will give you the silent treatment forever, if that's what they have to do. Especially if they know that it's making you miserable. But if you give the narcissist your silence, it is going to affect them. Because they can dish it out, but they can't take it. Narcissists are very weak and fragile people. If you reciprocated anything they've done to you, back to them, it would drive them insane. They wouldn't know how to deal with it. And that's why they dish it out to you. Because they already know that it's something they wouldn't be able to deal with. But when you give the narcissist your silence, you need to be unworried and unconcerned. You need to take away your emotions. Because the narcissist will be looking for a clue that they're having an influence or effect on you. But you have to give it to them before they can use it against you. The power is in your hands. You have to weaponize them. You have to make it possible for them to inflict harm on you by revealing your emotions to them. But if you withhold that from them, there's nothing they can do. It will leave them in a state of confusion. They won't know what to do next.
You just need to take away your emotions. You need to act dull and uninteresting. Be evasive. Be boring. And then you will repel the narcissist. They won't want anything to do with you. They will just go and find someone else who is more exciting to them. Because they're not getting anything from you, you're not giving anything to them. So now there's no reason for them to keep you around. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.